Welcome to Winescape TV. I'm your host, Dick and of course, we are very fortunate to have with us Pierre from Simon Sig Wine Estates in Stellenbosch from South Africa. He's there for a very short period of time, but what he's going to do is talk us through some of these wines. And I know we're moving on to our, our Sauvignon Blanc here, which uh, used to be called the Sunbird Sauvignon Blanc, but uh, we're not allowed to call it. Why is that? <laughs> it's a, a trademark uh, issue. Uh, <laughs> Luckily, we know the guy very well, so uh, we're allowed to use it for the rest of the world, but not the UK. Yeah, not allowed to use it here. So this is just going to be the Sauvignon Blanc. Um, please, Pierre, talk us through this. All right, Sauvignon, um, for this wine, we use uh, grapes from our own vineyards in Stellenbosch. It's about 70% in the blend. Um, Stellenbosch, the flavors we get there is a little bit more tropical. Um, and then we source a bit of grapes from cooler climate sites uh, around Darling. <laughs> Darling is about 50 kilometers north of Cape Town along the Atlantic coast. Uh, so the sites there are a little bit cooler and the, the flavors we get from those grapes is a little grassier, uh, more of the greener style style souvenirs. Mm -hmm. And when you blend that with our own, own fruit from Stellenbosch, it makes really good wine. Um, and sometimes these really cool climate wines can be almost too green, really great for tasting. Um, but you won't, you won't finish a bottle. <laughs> so by, by having some of the tropical fruit in with the greener notes, it makes yeah. a very food-friendly wine, something you can have a glass of easily by itself. I think also it's worth noting that, uh, no offense to the Kiwis, but I think uh, in, certainly in the UK that uh, we're finding that, you know, the Kiwi Sauvignon Blanc has, has I'm not saying it's had its time, the bubble burst maybe, I'm not saying um, but uh, this is a brilliant wine if you're looking at something a little bit different um, because as I said it's not sort of being slightly overblown uh, into sort of the uh, some of the sort of the consumer wines that you expect to find in supermarkets of course you won't find any of those at the general wine company but this is absolutely delicious it's uh, it's very very fresh it's not overly done with the gooseberries it's just very light it's got a lovely kiwi fruit to it as well so Pierre thank you for opening this this is absolutely delicious cheers